Hello YouTube, this is Kelly. I am so irritated with YouTube right now. I made a video, somebody, a couple of people viewed it, it said. So I apologize, it was only like 45 seconds long when it should have been 8 seconds long, or I'm sorry, 8 minutes long. I'm tired. Mother Nature hit me hard this morning, so it's like, you know, I was there last night, but it really hit me hard this morning. So anyway, um, this is, I want to thank uh, Courtney from Kyle and Court on YouTube um, for doing this 10-day challenge for healthier, for weight loss, for whatever, you know, just to maybe lose five pounds or whatever. But I want to thank you. It really has helped me. Um, my breakfast, I had one cup of Kellogg's Special K with red berries, my all-time favorite and half a cup of milk. That total came to four points. I'm on a 24-point plan with Weight Watchers. Excuse me. For lunch, I had Chinese takeout. I had a third cup of steamed white rice, and my dog's going to irritate me. Everything's going to irritate me. You know, it's Mother Nature time. So, I'm sorry. She's barking at my kids upstairs. And, oh, anyway. For lunch, I had Chinese takeout. My husband brought it home. One third cup of steamed white rice was one and a half points. The rice was not the white rice was not really good at all. It was kind of dry. Then I had a third cup of pepper steak that was one and a half points. And I had a veggie egg roll which was three points. I had two ounces of Colonel's chicken. Yes, I do. You can see this is my Weight Watchers um, scale. I weigh my food when I need to. Two ounces of general chicken, which was two points, and then I had lo mein, a third cup of lo mein, which is two and a half points. My lunch total came to ten and a half points. Now that's a big lunch for me. Even though it was small portioned, it was still a big lunch for me. And then for dinner, I had leftover Chinese. I didn't have any of the rice. I threw it out because it was dry. Somebody put it in the fridge and I wanted it kept in the microwave. Somebody put them in the fridge, which really irritated me, but anyway, the rice, I threw it away, so I didn't have any of that. I had what was left, one eighth cup of pepper chicken, or I'm sorry, pepper steak was one point. One egg roll, and I'm, I'm very proud of myself, because normally when I get egg rolls, I will eat them all. Like, on the night, that one of my mess up nights that I had, that I spoke of my mess up and fess up video, one of those nights I did have, and I ate like three egg rolls, so that was one of my test up mess ups, and I'm never going to have one of those again. Anyway, I had one egg roll for dinner, which came to three points, two ounces of general chicken, which came to two points, and a third cup, if that, of lo mein. It was just regular veggie lo mein. Um, had the lo mein, the noodles, and then it had the. Uh, Looked like cabbage and carrots, and that was it. And it was two and a half points. And I don't even—I didn't even have a third cup, but I still have one point. But I'm done. I'm—I'm I'm full. And I want to tell everybody that. Um. Okay. When I had, well, my mess up, mess up video explains it all. But I've lost from the first. I weighed myself this morning because it was the 10-day challenge, and I wanted to tell everybody my weight. Okay. I weighed on the 1st of November, I weighed 199, exactly. I had gained. And um, now, I woke up this morning and I weighed 190. Like I said, Mother Nature hit me hard. It could be water weight, a couple pounds, or a pound, or anything. It doesn't matter. But I want to say that I've lost, according to the skeletons of this morning, I've lost 9 pounds doing the 10-day challenge with Kyle and Court. And I want to thank you for that, Courtney. Um, but anyway, if, ever, if there's anybody out there that, you know, says there's no way that you could have lost nine pounds, I lost it. A lot of it was water weight because my ankles were swollen, especially my left one. And if you would have divulged Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, it, it, it's possible. And it's also possible to lose, especially if you were eating a lot of sodium, a lot of salt. Everything that I, that I ate had a lot of sodium in it, and I do retain water. That's one thing that I do do, and I need to go back to the doctor and get on some water pills, apparently, because I retain water, especially on a hot day, I do as well. 
because I drink a lot of sodas when it's hot. Right now, I'm down to maybe two sodas, one or two sodas a day. Normally one, but sometimes I'll have two. Anyway, to make a long story short, I've lost nine pounds from since the first, and um, I'm going to keep going strong. Um, as soon as I get done here, um, I've already exercised, but I want to do my wee fit boxing because I love that. It's fun, and it it doesn't look like a workout, but I tell you, you get up there and you do it, it's a workout. Anyway, everybody, stay blessed. Have a good night. Stay focused. Stay motivated. And stay positive. Because if you don't have positive, it's all going to fall apart. Keep your mind to it, and you will lose. I've seen people do it, and, you know, I just want to say, everybody have a good night, and, um... I'll talk to you soon. Sorry I'm such a in such an irritated mood. I'm very tired from one. I'm very agitated for another. But anyway, um, Mother Nature. Gosh, I hate her. Anyway, love y'all. Have a good night.